Hello, all you hardcore boxing fans out there. How are you doing? Russell from Porky's Corner. The 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 Scooby Doo. Russell from Porky's Corner, the voice of hardcore boxing. Big Dossa Femi. Big Dossa Femi. He's ended up at. Uh, He's ended up at the zone, hasn't he? How stupid. How stupid does Mr. Bean look now? Does Mr. Bean look stupid or what? Hey, How stupid does Bean look? I think we're pretty confident of, uh, of getting uh, Anthony Joshua to Sky. We've always had a good relationship with him. We've always had a great relationship with him, and it's uh, AJ all the way. A AJ after AJ. And that's what shit you were coming out with being. Well, look what's happened. AJ didn't care for legacy. He didn't care for loyalty. He cared for money. I want money. He cared for money. That's all he cares for. That's all. Okay, that is all he cares for. That's about it. Joshua don't care for anything else. He's not bothered about belts, but he's gone to that zone now, and it could could come back to bite him in half. That, but he's gone there, and Eddie thinks he's smug. But if he loses against Usyk, where are they going to go with him? Where can Eddie go with Joshua if he loses against Usyk? Where? Dylan White. Dylan White lost against Fury. And Joshua loses against Usek again. So basically, it's these are two losers, aren't they? Uh, fight, fighting it out for, uh, for bronze medal. Well, that's, what it, that's how it is, isn't it? These two, White and Joshua, when he gets beat, these are losers fighting out for bronze. That's how I look at it. They're not it. They're not at the top of the table like Usyk and Fury, are they? And that's what fight I think is going to happen. But is this a good move for Joshua going to that zone? Well, it's greedy, isn't it? He's greedy. I don't know what... I don't know what waffle Eddie Hearn's giving, but they've got him, haven't they? Fair enough. But he ain't got no hardware, has he? He ain't got no hardware, have they? He's a busted flush, isn't he? He's on his way down, isn't he? Maybe I am being harsh on him. Can he be Usyk? Never in a month of Sundays. That means never. The chances he's got of beating Usyk are slim and non, and slim's on remand in Armley. Double cat A. That's right. They're going nowhere. They're going nowhere. Slim's on remand. Other ones out of town, right? Uh, is it a good move? It will it be paid answerably? Answerably, well, if Canelo was on 35 million or around about that, you'd expect Joshua to be on a similar amount, wouldn't you? Sky probably didn't want to pay him that amount. Do I think that's good for the sport? I don't know, really. Does Joshua care about the sport? No, does Sky not really? Didn't they put Joshua on in Saudi? Sky. Sky don't care. They've protected Joshua all the way. I mean, little bits of tickle tackle, little bits of digs being aimed at Joshua and blah blah blah. But hey, listen, we were all they were everybody was all okay while the gravy train were coming in, wasn't it? While the gravy were flowing, Adam Smith were, were happy, wasn't he? Robert McCracken were happy. Well, now that the gravy's not flowing in their direction, everybody's unhappy, aren't they? Eddie's still all right, isn't he? Eddie will always be all right. But uh, do I feel... 
the Anthony and Joshua is not loyal. Who is loyal in boxing? Who? Everybody looks after themselves. Everybody looks after themselves. Yeah, we can call people brasses and stuff like that, but they're going to look after themselves. They're going to do what's best for them. They're getting punched in the head for a living. And that's not nice. Trust me. Ask my pal Max about being punched in the head, although he probably likes it. So, all right. So, peace out. Once again, thank you very much for people that have been subscribing to the channel lately and liking the videos and sharing them. All the percentages on analytics are up. So, thank you very much. Okie dokie. Peace out.